today we are here on the Fishkill Creek. We are hoping to collect some microplastic samples from this freshwater ravine. I am on a research team with Dr. Abul Baki. His project is looking for microplastics in freshwater ravines. So my role here is at the Lower Hudson area, collecting samples from all along the Fishkill Creek. So right now we are in Sarah Taylor Park. Microplastics are a big issue. They are ubiquitous. We're even finding that microplastics exist in infants even before they're born. And so we want to find a way to remediate this issue and getting out into our creeks and studying them, getting into our waterways. This is how we begin to come up with strategies to solve the problem. Some of the differences we might see between uh, what they find at Potsdam and what we find here is I can predict that we just have a lot more people, a lot more cars, a lot more traffic, which in turn comes with a lot more garbage down here in the lower Hudson area. So I'm predicting that we will find a lot more microplastic here in the lower Hudson than they do up in Potsdam. The result of a project like this could potentially give Clarkson a chance to influence positively an environmental challenge that affects not just the Hudson Valley and the North Country, but all of New York State and the world.